Hey, it's working. Alright. Quality is terrible. But. Hey, Tomac, how are you doing? Pretty good. I can't see how many people are here right now. Like, my tablet's not showing it right. Hey, Kayla Wash, welcome. Hey, DD. Okay. Sorry, I'm eating some frozen grapes right now as my dessert. Mm hmm. I'm going to get started in just a second. I've already got some points, but it was defense. So someone poured it in, and I sped in a march to try and kill some stuff. So this was the first hit after I got my march in there. So killed a bunch of troops. Um, but see the see the benefits. So I rained, but you know, looking at see the attacks or all the stats it shows in the. Um, in the report are what's messed up about it but second hit had the airship so it was a little bit more skewed because 604,000 was the maximum reinforcement that um, was available and then one more sent without the airship and I got a hold of that one and then the final one um, I didn't have many troops left so it didn't do much, but that's kind of what's happened so far. I also have troops in the hospital right now, so I might have to spend some gold. So, <laughs> let's do five for now. And I'll give myself four more if we need to go to Third Kingdom. Okay. So we're going to go to 293 first. To 616 mil even have troops at this point in the game. I don't even know anymore. It seems like castles are like huge with zero troops. So there may be something that I want to go check out with that 600 and something mil. And I need to get to this kingdom anyway, so maybe I'll go take a look at it. Because there's a couple... These are all dead already. Um, maybe I don't want to waste that port. Let me look at some other ones. I'm going to look from the bottom up. So the way I did my bookmarks, um, hey Liam, welcome, is each kingdom has its own tab. And I have to start over every kingdom raid now because um, basically we've been getting different kingdoms, which is awesome. Uh, and that's partially because our troop or stat leader has been dropping in stats because Dark hasn't been playing. So every time his stats are lower and lower and lower, we get back to a more even playing field where they don't have as many monster huge players. Okay. Gosh, so far... Not so good, but this kingdom has a lot. I have a lot of bookmarks. Is that the one I just checked? Still looking. Nothing there. Oh. Oh. Man, making me think I'm getting attacked back home. Okay, so this one... I see movement... 
1.8 billion. And a 40 at... That one's already zeroed out. Man, somebody was already burning this and they stayed away from that 1.8 million. I'm wondering what happened there. Don't get motion sick while I follow this. Holy crap. Oh. And it's nothing. Okay. So now let me get back to that one that I was just on, which was this one. So I need to go look and see if there's anything worth attacking a 1.8 billion for. So we'll go check it out. Hey Liam, uh, I just started. Um, you said 348. Yeah, I'm. I'm. Uh, I'm just starting my own. I'm not ready to go look at uh, other people's what they have going on. If you were in my group and you had that stuff ready to go, totally be all about it. Okay. Resources were next to me. Where? Oh, back home. It was uh, shield that up, and we can get them later. Okay, so nothing. Mikey has a little bit of silver. I'll take that. Oh, you know what I didn't do yet is <sighs> the stupid. Um, I didn't remake my marches, and I need to do that. So I was planning to change my marches around to make room for those new cavalry. And my march cap is much lower than it should be, and I can't figure out why. But let's get this silver, and then we'll figure it out. I think I need more marches to get the rest of that silver. Ooh. Is that the 1.8 billion? Okay, so... Let's look. There's a wall... Sort of. It looks... It's kind of like my wall, but not at the same time. He's got every tier, which I don't. Only 8.8 .8 million, but I probably will get wrecked. But let's see. I might I might do it. I might do it. That guy's got 1 million troops, so we'll smack those real quick, too. Um, did I get all the silver? I don't think I got all of it. Like, there should be another march left. Oh my gosh, I didn't even see all these comments, guys. I'm sorry. Um, so, let's see. Jaya, Jaya, how's it going? Um, Vass, Corey said Vass F Tech. I don't know what that means. I do have two 13s now. Hey, uh, Eminem and Key spent this event 190 pound already. You got 1.6 billion power today? That's crazy. Nice work. Okay, so Mikey has one more march worth of stuff. Let's go steal that. Let me scout some of these farms, see if there's any easy resources that I want. And then I'm trying to figure out if I want to try and kill the 8.8 .8 million troops or not. Anyone to Mega? Let's see if we can do it this way so I can save some troops. Um, while we're waiting for that, I'll just look around real quick. Hopefully nobody gets motion sick. Oh, what's this? A 1.3 billion. That one is a lower hanging fruit that we want to look at for sure. 
and always scout the farms because people's farms have my favorite thing on them which is resources okay not much there nothing there nothing there um, so this was the hit on the little baby castle not much to see here Studious has no resources and 4.8 million troops Looks like he's got a lot of... I mean, he's got 3 million tier 12, so that's decent. And then he's got a lot of artillery. I mean, a decent amount of artillery. It's interesting that his numbers are pretty exact. Like, he has the exact same amount of all three troops in each tier of each other, which is... It's that seems to me like he used a calculator, like some calculator told him to do exactly this to get best results. Okay, so what do I want to do here? Um, oh, I don't really like using up all of my um, my hospital things when there's um. You know, no resources. Um, so let's look at these real quick. And then, I don't know, what do you guys think? Warner Prince, how's it going? So this one has 2.66 mil on a farm. I definitely want to kill those because that's, you know... That's low hanging. Um, oop, resources. Not a much, not a ton, but resources all the same. I think I can kill that without my airship. Let me double check. Yeah. Nothing on that one. Nothing on that one. Let's send more marches at this because we need to collect all the resources. Okay, um, how many troops have I killed off? Uh, not many yet. We just started. Um, I don't know what I did with that report. See, other, who was the other big one? Was it Studious? Okay, so Studious and the other big guy. All right, so I find all three troop types compared to sending two types of troops now. Um, I don't have Bella, or I don't have Donna yet, so I can't send all three types. Um, if I had Bella and Donna, I would absolutely be sending all three types because that march is fantastic, but... Um, it's only with Bella and Donna that the full mixed march is good. And I don't have them. So I can't I can't really do that part yet. But yeah, it's um it's a really good march. It's really strong. Yeah, no. You wanna you wanna see my sadness, I'll show you in one second. It is Kind of ridiculous. So, let's look down here, and there she is. But then we can look at look at all these extra guards I've got. I'm so happy to have so many extra gold guards that I can't do anything with. Ah, oh, and still no Donna. So that's one of my my sad panda moments. So it looks like there's still some resources on Little Blue. So we'll finish getting those. Um, it makes me want to scout the rest of these tiny little farms around here while I'm waiting to figure out what I want to do. Uh, 
Oh man. Um, Bell skills. Bella is yeah, full level ten, maxed level eighty. Got everything I can on her. And the only reason I have her, I've not pulled her. The only reason I have her is because she's the one that you get fragments from during the summon events. So that's the only reason that I have her um, in the three star range. Oh, there's food. That's why we scout the baby castles, everybody. This is why we do it. Because sometimes they have resources that we want. This one has a tiny bit of wood. So let's attack it. Um, and then we're going to, once I get a chance, did I kill the rest of the troops on that? Almost. I got it close enough that I'm not going to send another march for the what's left. I don't need to send it over there for 60k troops. I'm not that concerned with it. Um, little blue, 812,000. I think that's fully cleared now. I'll double check. And I'm going to keep scouting these babies because I want more resources. Just tell me your power. <laughs> I'm not going to go look right now. I'm in the middle of my own stream, bud. Um, use who there, Miss? Oh, um, Bell and Aramis. I use that in um, in Fort, and yeah, that's my march in Fort. Okay, let's change it right now. Why not? Let's do it. Okay, so we're gonna change this one to be. Bella, and the monkey, and some tier 13s. I don't have many yet. Uh, I only have 446k, so I don't have many. Uh, that's what I built yesterday. And I could have done more. I have the resources to do it and all the stuff, but I'm just going to wait. Okay trying to get my tablet set up so I can actually read the you got 730 wood, 237 iron, and 80 oh my gosh, lucky Thanatos um, upgrades this week are going decent um, just looking at the thing, I have a thousand presents and the only thing so I bought all of the badges out um, because I, that's how I got my tier 13s and then I also bought some of the Obsidian Guard weapons. So I've spent like 1,500. So I've probably had 2,500 presents so far. So my upgrades are going all right. Um, today's upgrades, I had, I did just a little bit. Um, so a couple of tiers, I upgraded some, some of the old gems. I don't have any new ones. And then I upgraded Curiosity twice. Uh, didn't do any Guard Recruits. Lucky eggs is pointless. And then I'm not going to show you that recharge tab because it shows you that I haven't been a good boycotter. <laughs> so we're not going to show you that. <laughs> um, <laughs> but yeah. So there's a farm right next to me there. Farm here. Farm here. Blue's farm had stuff. So let's scout blue. And we'll scout this person too. So do you guys think... Like, the one that has 8.8 .8 million troops is the one that has a little bit of resources. But it is going to make me spend gold to have to kill it, is, is the issue that I have. And most of the time, I don't actually care that much about, like, kills. I want resources. So, let's look at that report again. Um... And let's look deeper at it. So Koja is the one. So he's only got 34 million wood. Killing 8.8 .8 million troops is going to cost me... It's going to make me use my hospital healing buff. And I'm going to have to spend gold to heal my hospital again. So it's going to cost me a whole bunch of gold for 34 million wood. Which isn't really worth it. 
Um, Studious has 4.8 million troops. Um, yeah, nobody for Omega. Our kingdom is so dead. Um, oh, do the stat comparison thing. You're right. Um, which one was it? Where did it... Didn't I start it? Okay, so Kolja... Is that rained? Oh man, look at that. So on top of it, he's fully rained. So... There's almost 10 million troops there. His stats are... Better than mine? Why is this out of order? I don't understand why this is so out of order. Okay. Troop attack. Um, so I've got him beat on research. Got him beat on damage. He's in the talent spec equipment. I've got him beat slightly, but he is in the right gear. I've got him beat slightly in buildings and cavalry. Curiosities, I have him beat by a little bit. So his stats are really close to mine to the point that I'm just going to go splat. Um, not worth it. Let's look at Studious because he's got some troops, maybe. And he's also rained. So these guys rained, fully rained, the people that are unshielded, which is cool. Um, to protect them. So he's not in his war spec, but he is in his battle gear, but his stats are significantly lower. So my stats are much better than this guy. I wonder if that one might be worth hitting. So the one that's way over here is the one, Studious. I don't know... Let's see, let's jump. I would love to jump right here, but that stupid thing is in the way. Um, the question is, do I want to waste a port? I probably do, so I'm closer. Let's scout these other little things real quick, and then, then we'll go for it. I think I might have scouted these already, but since I blew the reports, um, I can't see them. So we'll rescout just to make sure. And then we'll go for it. I kind of wish that I could attack that level 8 threat and get it out of the way and get closer. Yeah, there's nothing on any of those. Okay, so I think for this I need to clear my hospital, or look at my hospital at the very least. So I have room for 700k, so not enough for my full march. So we've got to spend the gold. Um, we'll start that healing. We are going to fully buff up for this one. I won't get resources from 296. I'm in 293. Um, okay, so fully buffing. Because why not? Might as well use these two. I'm not going to attack with any distance, but... If I get hit, it's worth it. And we're going to use this for the first one to try and save my troops. And we'll just speed it up a tiny bit. Do you want resources from 293? I always want resources. Okay, so 1.7 million kills. Let's take a look at what actually happened there. So I killed 
all of his tier 12 infantry, all of his tier 10 infantry, so all of his even tier troops are gone. Um, I didn't break through to his cavalry. Um, I got through to his tier 12 or his tier 10 distance and some of his even tier distance. So I have to get through all of the cavalry still and a few more infantry. So it's still going to be tough. Um, let's go back in. And let's spend the gold. I don't like spending this much gold, but we're going to do it. And the next one, I'm trying to decide if I really need another one of the boosters. I think I need one more of the the hospital boosters. Because if I don't use it, then I'm probably going to lose real troops on this one. So I think I'll use one more, and then I shouldn't need it after that. I think. But we'll find out. Uh, who used distance guards heated on his wall? Okay, so this one was a win. And I only had 154,000 wounded. So that means the next hit, I won't need the thing, and I'll be able to finish off the last 2.6. So looking at what actually happened on this one while it comes back, um, the rest of his infantry are gone. I made it partway into the cav and partway into the distance. So the next one should, there should be no infantry protecting them, and I should be able to swoop in and do a lot of damage with my infantry cav march. So this next one should hurt him pretty good. Um, I'm sending less. I should be sending more. How many do I have in my march right now? It's only 250k. Man, okay. So I should reduce my cav a little bit more and boost my infantry. That's kind of what I do in, in fort, and it does work well. So you're right. Okay, so this one, now we're getting into it. Okay, so, battle details, cavalry are gone, next one is against full distance, so the next one, because it's full distance, I can send my full cav march, or mostly cav march. because there's only distance left. Yeah, I left a tiny bit of infantry on there. I could have gone just full, full distance. Um, but I'd ra rather have the infantry die than my new cavalry. Which they technically should absorb the hits first. But let's see. Let's watch what happens. Okay, so this one clearing the, cleaned him out. Not too bad. Um, lost a little bit. But yeah, overall stats pretty pretty significant. Oh, you know what I better make sure? Because I am I did it. Every time I say I'm not going to do it, and I did it again. Because it was... Oh well. This is a judgment-free zone, right? <laughs> judgment-free zone. I think every time at the start of a stream, someone needs to say, Key, don't forget your damage frames. Because <laughs> I do it every single time. <sighs> oh, man. It wouldn't have made that much of a difference, would it? Um, <laughs> I hope it wouldn't have made that much of a difference. Maybe a little bit. My bad. These things happen. Okay, I had to go pick up pizza from Little Caesars and feed everybody, and then get back here to stream, and I was unshielded the whole time. 
Uh, 552 got 206, 458, and Kingdom 21. Very strong. Dang. Yeah, it's it's weird for me to um, have been getting different opponents every single time now. And it's cool, um, but it's also a lot of work because uh, I don't get to reuse bookmarks. So there's that piece of it that you know, when we were getting the same matchups all the time, I saved bookmarks and I would just have the same ones and I wouldn't have to do anything. Um, but now I kind of have to do new bookmarks every time because we're getting so many new kingdoms. I don't see much in here. Next bookmark, please. <clears throat> Drink of water. So the Kingdom Raid matchmaking, something we figured out a long time ago, is based on your top stat player. Uh, at least that's one of the factors. Because every Kingdom Raid that we've ever had had at least one player in their kingdom who was near maxed out. And that was because Dark was maxed and up-and-coming kingdoms have it. Um, you can see that if you pay attention to the matchups. Like an example is Kingdom 676. They've got some really big players, and they're kind of in the in the spot that we were before, where they're getting matched up against, you know, kingdoms in the top ten uh, because they have a player that's nearly maxed, uh, and that's nothing they can really do about it. Pass for Zola. My luck. I'll get frozen and mega like. Yeah, I hate getting frozen. <laughs> um, getting Megad, I mean, I don't think I'm going to take any more Megas unless I really know what I'm up against. Um, just because it, it ends my Kingdom Raid. Um, getting Megad and losing, you know, even if I win it and all of my infantry die and some of them are, are in the, the losses section, it ends me being able to go back out and, and do more fighting. So I don't think that I'll take another Mega unless it's from someone that's much closer to my, my power level versus you know some of the Megas I've taken before. Someone's at 608 million. I bet you that's already zeroed. 407, 97. Most of these look kind of dead already. Okay. Yep, they're all dead already. They had people starting right away when when Kingdom Raid started to, so I wouldn't be surprised if somebody, because they had a there's like a seven billion guy that's out and about, and uh, he seemed like he had good bookmarks because I followed him to a couple of places and saw that he was doing it, but I was unavailable. Yeah, zero, zero, zero. Look, one of them's actively burning right now, so somebody's somebody's here. I just gotta find them. One point five. Okay, let's let's go there. We'll go take a look at that. We'll scout these other ones because I always scout. And let's see what this guy's working with. All right, chill out this raid. Ooh, 500k permadeath, that's that's rough, man. Like, in KVK now, I get all my losses back. In Kingdom Raid, I don't get it back, and it's hard to, like, really see what you're losing. Because it's, like, little bits here and there. Okay, so this guy's got silver. He's got 1.6 million infantry, 1.3 million cav... He's all tier 12, pretty much. Except for a whole couple of tier 11 um, artillery, for some reason. Okay, so research. I've got him smoked in research. Talents. Gear by a little bit. Buildings by a l like 2,000 in cavalry. Um, curiosities. So I've got him by about six to seven thousand stats. 
That's a lot of tier 12, though. Man. Uh, okay. So you said less of that, more of that. Let's do it. See what happens. Let's see the fire. Please fire. No fire. Ugh. I hate when there's no fire. Okay, so I didn't lose a lot. But he did. So let's take a look at the report real quick. See what we're working with. I broke through half of the distance and cracked into or part of the distance and half of the infantry so the next hit should be decent I also need to adjust this march so I don't have to automatically adjust it as often oh that's too much let's do that okay motion detected at my driveway that means my daughter's home which means it'll flag again in a second okay Let's see it. There's the fire that we were looking for. Okay, so a million kills, or a million losses in the hospital, and now we're getting into kills. So the rest of it is this next hit should hit pretty hard. Um, his infantry's gone. He's got distance and cavalry left. So the next hit should do it. Let me um, real quick adjust this so I can be lazy. Adjust it once so you can be lazy later. Is Okay, wait. I need to do this one down a little bit. Okay, that's good. Let's save it there. Okay, so let's finish him off. Hopefully he didn't get rained in the uh, 30 seconds that I was busy. Oh, man. And the only reason that I actually would go for another bigger castle like this right now is because he does have the resources. And I want them. So after this next hit, we should be able to swoop in and finish out getting that 12 million silver that he's got. Um... And that's the real goal here. If he had zero resources, I probably wouldn't have even bothered. Hopefully my last march finishes it off because I'm I'm committed. We're sending it, sending the cavalry. Yep, zero losses. So now we get all this silver that I want. There it is. So there's the final hit. I'm guessing that I need to send probably two or three more marches, and that should clear out the silver. So whoever's burning in front of me is not burning bigs. They're just burning littles. I mean, I might as well scout these to, to verify that they're empty, because it only takes me a minute, and I've got to go look for other targets anyways. Did I already scout that one? I don't remember. Okay, so... Oh, he was still giving silver on the on that last hit, so I've got to send one more. So let's do that. Did you get smaller castle resources? Um, hey, Jonathan. Um, I did check for some smaller castles and look for resources. Uh, I always try and check smaller castles because I found one that had 15 million wo or food, which is pretty good. Um, gee, okay, 1.6. That's that's zeroed because I can carry 2.5 million silver with my main march um, on with my airship. So we're gonna scout a couple of these little ones real quick. I think. That's all of them, and then we're on to the next bookmark. So, I mean, might as well scout this one and see what happens. Is there anything else over here? Mm, not really. So where am I right now? I am in Russ. So, 
looking at bookmarks. Russ, now we're on WRS. Okay, so there's castles here. He's probably zeroed. Um, these look like they've already been cleared out. This kind of looks familiar. I think I already checked them. Okay, so WRS, SOS, Rafal. PFF, no longer there. So the PFF with the Asian name is gone. Um, SSS, I think I bookmarked two in here. That one's probably got troops on it. We'll go check that one out. Hey, thanks, Sean. Uh, thanks for showing up. Appreciate the support. Oh, man. Of course I can't get close on this one. That bothers me. Whatever. Scout it all. Scout it all. Um, the one thing I can't see right now is I can't see how many people are actually here because my tablet is not showing me that piece for some reason. Um, oh, no, I can. 29. Okay. I just didn't know where to look. So, yeah, thanks, everybody, for showing up. I appreciate it. Um, okay. Oh, you know what I did? I teleported before I actually looked at the scouts I sent out. So, if there's anything really good, I'm going to have to go back. So, hopefully there's not. That was kind of a... Oop. Oh, oh. There's a little bit, not a lot there, but a little bit. So we'll send the march, and then let's look at this other one. Nothing really here. Uh, I do have tier 13s. Um, I have been a bad boycotter. Um, <laughs> this deal right here. So I don't buy this one. Right, because that's less than a dollar batch. But this one is fifty cents a batch. So I buy this every day times three. So I've been buying six badges a day every day that that deal has been up. Sorry that I'm a bad uh, <laughs> a bad boycotter, um, but you know, like I had to get my tier thirteens. So I'm slowing down again now because. I don't really, I mean, I kind of want to go for the tier 12 infantry, but I think I need a lot of badges to make it happen. Um, because looking at, let me refresh this real quick. So looking at my barracks, it's only level 41. <laughs> so the one that I really care about would be getting to, you know, tier 13 infantry. And that means it's, 300 to 42, another 300 to 43, and 444. So I need a 1,000 badges. So that's not happening anytime soon. So I'm going to be happy with my one single tier 13 troop, which is cavalry. And that's that's it. Uh, that's all I'm going to do. So, you know, I just, uh, I think I'm going to slow down and just collect badges where and when I can. And... You know, maybe, okay, that's the one I had bookmarked. Um, you know, maybe if they do any more, like, amazing deals, I'll buy some more. But, ooh, this is a big hive. Okay. Harry Potter, 1.6 billion. We will go look. Thor, 1.6 billion. This one is smaller. But man, they got big guys in here. So Stifler, okay, he's not that bad. These guys could freeze me. And they probably have enough people to put a Mega on. So things could get interesting if I pour it in here. Or I should say when I pour it in here, because I'm going to go. I just need the best spot for multiple targets, which is what I'm looking for right now which looks to be right in here. 
that looks like my spot. Oh, uh, keep it under five minute cooldown. That's a good point. Right now I have a 12 minute cooldown, so not really gonna work out. If I have to take a mega, I have to take a mega. It's one of the risks of going into someone else's territory during Kingdom Raid is that you will get frozen and lose all of your stuff. That's always a risk. So this one has some troops and some resources. Seth has resources and not many troops. So we're going to hit Seth right after I hit this other one. Okay, so I didn't kill them all with the first march. So we have to wait for the march to come back. We'll burn this one again. I did get a good spot for this though, so I don't have to use speed ups. Hey, thanks, uh, Nuck and Foob, for showing up. Appreciate the support. Have a good night. Um, okay, so almost got them all. 149,000 left. Let's hit Seth with the main march. And then we'll hit this one with the secondary march because there should be enough troops left that I don't need to worry about it. Legally high, nothing. Asian nay, oh. Oh. Oh boy. We got to kill 7 million troops. But look at the prize. That one's a prize worth getting. Okay, so. Anyone on to Mega? I may have to solo it to get the sweet loot that I'm after. Okay, so Seth should have had a little bit more resources. Did I get them all when I killed Seth? It was 2 million silver. Oh, I didn't finish him anyway, so let's finish him. Okay, um, yeah, that's that's the that's a good little jackpot, but it's a lot of troops to get through. So, oh man, man, oh man, oh man, this is the part that's okay. So let's look at the report. He's got max airship. Anne and Aramis on the wall. He's got a bunch of smaller tier troops that are going to be a pain. He's fully reigned with tier 12s. So, stat comparison is going to be where the decision happens. Okay, I've got him on research by a little bit. His talents. His equipment is similar to mine his buildings he's got better than me his curiosities are just barely under mine he's got like 27k stats there's no way we're cracking that without full megas unfortunately it's sad to let that um to let that wood go but i cannot crack that alone um it's just not gonna happen so we'll try and see if anybody else is has left anything valuable which if there's one there may be more um it's always worth taking a look around see what there is so this is one time that i really really miss dark Ooh, of course, that's the other monster. So, more resources, 98 million iron, but he's got 11 million troops. And I'm guessing he's fully reigned. Yes, he is. And let's go take a look at the benefit comparison. So, the only time that this is really, like, that I'd really be able to do some damage on a big castle like that is if I go to this equipment tab, look at the army damage and army damage received. If that is zero, that means he's not in his in his 
uh, battle gear, and that's the only time that's really, really going to make a difference. So this guy has probably 24,000 stats, so the stat difference isn't that much bigger on that one. But again, 11 million troops is not something you can easily just smash through unless you're a mega monster, like Dark. So, let's keep looking. I know it's sad to leave resources on the table, but there's a reason why these guys can sit unshielded, because... With 11 million troops, you need you need somebody. Someone's gonna have to mega you, and I just don't have people on to mega with right now. Let's take a look at all these little ones. God, Widow's Castle would be nice, but aren't the stats on Widow's Castle now about where we're at? Okay, not much there, not much there, Thor has a lot of troops, no resources though, so meh, right, mini Thor doesn't have anything, tiny Spud doesn't have anything, K60s, there's 866k troops, maybe I'll just send a march to, I want to start some fires in this, in this hive, um, Maybe I can get them to Mega Me, after all. I don't know who their leader would be, but... There was another big guy that was unshielded. And I don't remember where. Let's send some more scouts and see. Front door. There was one more big that I saw that was unshielded. Or did I already land to it? Oh, Harry Potter, that's the other one that we need to look at. Man. There's some troops there. I'll probably hit that one just to do it. Uh, Hulk. Tiny bit of troops. Asset. Tiny bit of troops. Oh wait, that's not a tiny bit of troops. That's 5.8 million troops on a... On what? On a C-30? What? That guy's crazy. Okay. Oh, oh, there it is. There it is. Oh my gosh. There we go. We found it. We found it. Thomas, come on. I know you want to get in here. Come on, man. There it is, boys. Jackpot. Jackpot and a half. And they left me a spot right next to him. Uh, I should look at the troops first. No, I shouldn't. It's a C-37. We're going. Come on. Here we go. That's what we're talking about. Look, there's more over here, too. This is why we kingdom raid. This is why we kingdom raid. Okay, so. Woo. I gotta kill the troops before I can start going crazy. Thomas, you wanna get in here? You can, man. <sighs> oh, let me link this. Bam. Kingdom chat. All are welcome. Okay. Bam. There it is. I've invited everybody. So nobody feels left out. I still got 3 million troops to kill. I'm not losing much yet. But we are getting big chunks of wood. So 1.7 million left. Oh man, 41 people here to see the glory of Kingdom Raid. 
Okay, last march. And the feeding frenzy begins. Okay, so... Here goes. So now, when you're doing a feeding frenzy like this, you still have to pay attention, because if anybody sneaks rain into him, and it's not my airship march, it's going to hurt. So I still have to pay attention here. I can't be complacent. Um, complacency leads to dead troops, all right? So when you're in a feeding frenzy situation, remember to watch the castle that you're attacking. See, it's happening right now. So let's cancel this, call it back. So see this happening in front of our faces? So he just got rained. So now I need to smack that with my main march and clear it out and see what the damage is before I continue feeding frenzy. He has farms. Oh, right next to it. Oh, dude, you're right. You're so right. If that has, if that's loaded up too. Not as much, but yeah, you're right. Okay, so they're reigning with one troop? Is that, did he really reign with one troop? Was he trying to get my stats? Okay, well, I mean, more power to you, I guess. Or seeing if I'm paying attention. Oh boy, this is why we Kingdom Raid. This is why Kingdom Raid is my favorite event. I didn't see who sent it, but it was someone over here. I don't know if they, how they're going to save this guy. One way they could save him is to kingport him. Right, because if you king port him away, I won't be able to get to him. But if they want to try and rein him and do that type of stuff, they're going to have to be willing to lose their troops to do it. And they might not realize how many resources this guy has. Like some people are like, yeah, like, oh, he's getting attacked. And they don't realize that he's sitting on a billion resources. Like there's no reason to ever sit on a billion resources open. So what else did he have? Did he have a bunch of iron and stuff too? Because it seems like I'm not getting that much wood right now. It's all iron and silver still. And I like iron and silver, but I like the big numbers from, um, let's see, let me scout, let me see the scout report. Latest report, so, oh, he had 56 million iron too. This is going to take forever. <laughs> this is going to take so long. First world problems. Like, uh, it takes too long for me to loot all of the resources. Let's use this too. Let's make it a little bit faster. Okay, so while well, we're enjoying the fire and the fun, how's everybody doing? Oh, you had two million or two billion open because of raid loot. I mean, I could see that, but this guy's a C thirty seven, so I doubt his is raid loot. Like it, that seems unlikely. So I'm still getting into the getting the silver out of the way, but then after the silver's out of the way, I'll start pulling in like thirty five to forty million a march, in at least my airship march, and that'll make a big difference in. Um, and how fast we clear this castle out. And even though I invited everybody in the kingdom, nobody came. Which is sad. Because Kingdom 524 is kind of dead right now. So this is, yeah, now we're breaking into the wood, or into the wood only. Like the iron and the silver are gone. So now it'll start clearing out much faster. And the, uh, the amounts are going to go way higher. So it won't take too long. I'd say probably another 20, 30 marches. And you'll see those wood numbers just climbing fast. You have 4.8 billion wood open at the moment? Holy crap. Oh, is it dropping quality? Sorry if it is, guys. Um, 
I don't have much control over that piece of it. That's the one downside to live streaming versus recording is that if if my bandwidth gets limited because of, you know, whatever the reason, that, uh, you know, I can't do much about it. I was having some trouble the other day with um, my upload speed. So we have gigabit, uh, gigabit internet, ethernet, or internet, um, and even though I'm on mobile right now, I still get like three or 400 uh, megabytes a second. So there were times where it's supposed to be kind of even, and I'd be down at like 20 or 30 up, which was odd. Um, okay, still going. We're almost there. No resistance so far. Keep paying attention just in case. Always stay vigilant. Always look for people getting ready to attack me. Oh yeah, I have fiber. Um, and we've, we've had it for a long time. So we were in one of the, in the, uh, ooh, 50 million a pull with my airship, Martin. That's fantastic. Is that clear? It might be clear. Let me send one more. And then I'll scout it just to be sure. Oh, still 141 left. Okay. Okay, we'll get there. Oops, wrong march. Oh well. Okay, this should finish it off. Um, yeah, I've got Kyger, uh, fiber, and we were we were on the pilot program for fiber. So uh, originally, when we got it, it was locked in at like sixty dollars a month, and we got that contract for like three years. So it was quite awesome. Okay, now we're gonna go and kill the farm. Oops, let's wait for that to come back. I'm going to kill a farm with my main march, and we're going to make sure that this is empty with the secondary march. Let's scout this little farm, because you never know what you're going to find. When there's other resources around, there's other resources around, you know? Okay, so getting the troops there... Okay, fully cleared. Little E has nothing. Rob Hell has nothing. Ernan has stuff. So we're going to have to use just our main marches for a minute while we kill troops. And then after the troops are dead on little Ar on Lord Arthur's farm, we'll send all of the um, we'll send my secondary marches to finish getting the resources. And then we'll attack the main... Oh! So the bubble, the snowman, is now here. So maybe I need to attack with just my main march and pay attention. So who, did he reign King Arthur or Lord Arthur? I guess I'll find out in a second. So he didn't reign him. Um, so this guy had iron, was iron and silver. So the iron will get cleared out first, and I just need to watch for those rain lines. So I think he rained the wrong castle, not realizing that I've moved on. Which is fine with me. <laughs> it's, it's fine that he's not quite paying attention to which one I'm attacking. Like, okay, that's totally fine with me, guy. Okay, so we're getting still a good spread. It's going to be like this for a while where we, um, we're getting iron and silver, which are super slow moving. So just pay attention to those reins. If I miss it, shout at me. Don't want to make a mistake again. 
Yeah, raining the farm would not be great for him. But you never know what people want to do to try and save resources. Okay, so Lord Arthur, I'm into the silver now. So that's good. So it shouldn't be actually too many more attacks to have this one fully cleared. And then we'll start on the next one. 2.4 million, 850k. I think I'll send a scout to know how much is left. So, oh, it's clear. Okay, and just like that, we're on to the next. So Lord Arthur and his farms. He is so sad. Hey, Corey, welcome. You know, you've been here talking. I just haven't been looking at the names. <laughs> My bad. My bad. Okay, so... You know, I'm okay leaving those other resources now that we found more. And oof. Let's clean this one up. So one more march. Oh, rain. Nope. That's his march coming back. So this one will finish it. And then we want to send one, two, three. Because this one only had a little bit. So this actually should get cleared out in these marches. Okay, now, which castles have not been scouted? Because we're not done yet. We're not done yet. I scouted Mini Thor and Thor and Rob Hell. This guy's not not tagged, but sometimes I've seen people um, remove somebody's tag in the hopes that someone will think it's a dead castle and just skip it, which is a legitimate strategy. And I never scouted Harry Potter because we found a billion wood. So let's go back and take a look at Mr. Harry Potter. Mr. Potter. So Thunder... Let's send a faster march here so that I don't have to have my march out for too long. James Bond, nothing. Actually, a dead castle. Nothing there. Peter has troops. Maybe I'll smack those. Harry Potter has, wow, 8 million troops and, like, the smallest amount of resources that I've ever seen on a castle during Kingdom Raid. <laughs> oh, man. But... You guys know how I feel about this. I don't care about his troops um, when he has no resources at all. It's kind of sad to have no resources. Like, this one will kill the troops because I can actually do it without, like, sacrificing a ton of, of true death kills. And I think that's the difference. Is I, I don't want to sacrifice you know, hundreds of thousands of troops just to kill somebody else's troops. Um, that's not really my, you know, style, I guess. Oh, my little one's being a jerk. I can hear her throwing a fit. So, depending on how things are going, I may have to go regulate for a minute I gotta go give her the dad look we'll see we'll see if I get called in for uh, for backup this one's got a little bit of wood on it it's a tiny bit let's get it let's take those resources millions of resources open and the main has billions of resources open oh I hope your friend bubbles it up you should have saved it for me hey Matthew welcome um, okay, so, past hoof, it says I have reports, okay, so I think I'm done in this hive after I take these tiny bit of resources, this wasn't even the last one, was it, this is PFF, let's go look for, okay, so he's gone, let's go look at this KVK alliance, oh wait, that's where I'm at right now, isn't it? 
No, it's not. But they're under um, Alliance Bubble. So they. Everybody from KVK is safe right now. Okay, that's it for this kingdom. So. I'm going to random, and I'm going to start checking some bookmarks in, in other kingdoms to decide which one I want to go to next. Um, there should not be a stream limit <clears throat> while using Streamlabs. Um, hopefully not, but it did happen previously where a stream got cut off after like an hour and a half. So hopefully that does not happen again. Um, <clears throat> but everything I researched as far as YouTube and other things said that it wasn't a YouTube issue. It was a stream. It was an issue with the, the app. So three ninety nine. Let's start looking. So, okay. Bubbles. So that was the very bottom. So that one was what? KOA. So ANA. Bubbles, uh, motion sickness warning, don't get sick. Uh, I'm zoomed out as far as I can. The game doesn't allow a lot of zoom. I wish I could zoom farther out. Okay, so this one, there's a C41 that is dead. Alliance bubble on AP2. So anybody I see for AP2, I can ignore for now. All right, so next is Fap. He's bubbled. So 399 might be one to skip for now if this is a theme where everybody's bubbled. Fap. I, I, I. Bubbles. I see bubbles. See thirty. See thirty. Okay. Um, moving on. So da da da. AP two. Everybody AP two is under bubble. One two three. One two three is bubbled. Bubbles, bubbles, bubbles. Dang, this kingdom is locked up tight, man. I haven't seen one like this in a while. This is what used to happen when Dark was around. AP3, I don't think I even have bookmarked, so let's add that for later. They're under Alliance Bubble. Fap, I already looked for. Bubbles. Wow. This is just madness. Okay, so I went to 123. Let's go check Russ. And then we'll check TDX. Oh. He looks zeroed already. 617. Somebody beat me to it. Not much here. Okay. Let's check. TDX. Bubble. Okay. Go to your castle, go to report, and click on the cords. Then you have a bigger view. Say what? But then I can't do that while I'm in this kingdom. Or in the new kingdom. Like I can... Oh, does somebody... Oh, well, um, let's see, TDX, I just checked that, checked the wolf. This kingdom is not even worth it. Gosh. Already dead. Maybe some troops there? I can't tell. OK. 
Okay, giant. Already dead. Already dead. Someone's been here already. Somebody has been here already. Unfortunately. So let's check Euro UER. Already dead. Enter castle first. But I have to be in this kingdom, right? Okay. Entering castle. Clicking report. Clicking war. And then I click. Do I click the top one up here? Or do I click actually on the thing? You got freeze, two megas, and solos against me. 980k tier 10, 12 dead forever. Oh my gosh, that's insane. Damn, sorry, Tom. Oh, say, tell Ghost High for sure. Okay. I don't know all these, these special tricks that you guys have. Okay, so that looks a little farther out, but then can I still, if I go to my bookmarks, does it stay zoomed out? Hey. You dirty hackers. Good job. <laughs> I like it. It's hard to see, though. I'm not used to this. This kingdom is so bubbled. Okay. Switching lanes. Let's go check out 449. Bubbles. Guys, if I keep finding bubbles, it may be the end. Okay. Bubbles, bubbles. Who is this? He's from a different kingdom. 12 billion? Oh, that's a bug. 293 is not in our pool this time. Or wait, is 293 in our pool? Oh, it is. Okay, never mind. So Groot, at 12 billion power, is out and about. So I wouldn't want to take a Mega from him. Um, let's see. So that was only like my second or third bookmark in this. Capo, not there. Let's look at fun. Ooh, maybe. But I'm guessing that since the 12 billion power guy is in this kingdom, that he already killed everybody. And why, why would you bubble if you're 12 billion power? Like, isn't that like a, a free pass to never bubble? Unless you're like... Unless he still thinks Dark Mystic is alive. Because I, I gotta. I can pretty much guarantee that he's the biggest player in this entire pool. And he should not be bubbled. But he has already killed everybody. Everybody's already dead. That's so sad. Everybody's already dead. Man. This is a cool trick though. You guys and your fantastic little hacks. So the question I have, we've been asking for years and years to allow us to zoom out more. If we can zoom out this far, and we can zoom out even farther when we place towers in like Ultimate Alliance campaign and stuff, why the heck don't they just give us this much? Oh no, I screwed it up. Okay, into the castle. Into a report. Click the name. Hack the game. Bookmarks. So we were just at fun. And they are all dead. OPG? I'm guessing that they're all dead too already. Dead. Dead. C31, C32, bleh. I think, I think we may be about done, everybody. 
Um, OPG, that's who I just checked. Let's look at Spa Deadpool. He's bubbled. Let's look at Porky's. He's bubbled. Let's look at Spa Alliance Fortress. I thought I saw them under Alliance Bubble, which I did. Jeez. Oh, so many bubbles. It's a sad, sad day. They saw that Keychain was live and they all bubbled. <laughs> I wish I was that strong. <sighs> yeah, Ghost is a monster. Um, hey man, if he was in our grouping, there's a 12 billion here that he'd be able to do some rallies on. But that, this is my last bookmark, and they are bubbled. So I'm still in Kingdom 293. If anybody wants to um, do some scouting in 293 or look around, uh, you know, I'd welcome that. But I'm going to recheck bookmarks just to double check stuff. Okay, wait, let me hack. Okay, so my estate, war, report, click stats, done. Oh, ghost man, I left some big players alive because they're too big for me. Um, over here, there's this guy. So he's at 1.7, but I think he had like... Let me delete all these and see what I did. So I killed Ernan, I killed Pete, I killed Arthur. Did I kill Bassett? I don't remember if I actually killed Bastet. Bastet's bubbled. Oh, and I did the thing again. Okay. Um There is, uh, is there a way to break, freeze, and use shield? Um, not a legitimate way. Um, there may be one of these guys, maybe one of these guys in chat has a magic trick like they just showed me. Um, maybe if you were in another kingdom when it happened, you're kind of SOL. But if you're in the other kingdom and it happened, um, you could have, let's see, if you were in your own kingdom, I wonder if the king port or the shield break could have saved you, eviction. Um, because when your walls burn to zero, it forces a port. Um... So your own alliance, if you were in your territory, could have dropped you out of the alliance and evicted you from the alliance territory, which should force support from your wall burning, regardless of whether you're you're on um, frozen status. Oh, you're in the enemy kingdom? Then once you burned, you should have got sent home. But if you had a lot of troops, you're probably losing a lot before you actually burned which is probably why you lost so much. Um, did they at least lose more than you, or were they on, like, a mega big... Um, a mega big guy killing you? So the other one that had troops left, um, for Ghost or whoever's watching, is we left Harry Potter with troops because he had 8 million. Uh, that was more than I wanted to chunk through, although he only had less than 3 million tier 12. He just had a mess of a wall. And it looks more like mine, but I don't know. Plus, he was rained. And he didn't have any resources, so I was like, mm, meh. So what else were we looking at? Bastet, who is now bubbled. Peter had 1.1 million. Did we kill Peter? Or did I forget? Oh, I see red lines. Who? 
come on and load now. Did somebody attack? I don't see who attacked in here if somebody broke bubble. Oh, nope, there it is. 1.99, so probably too big to solo. But that guy broke bubble. Um. Oh. <sighs> Yeah, Tom, so if you would have lost, like on your on the battle report, when it shows a loss, that's when you burn. So um, an example would be, where's one that, that I won, but barely. So when was this? Okay, so like this one, he took a bunch of losses, but he wouldn't have burned there. But I think the next attack after it, he burned. So on this one, if he was in my kingdom, because the fire started on his castle and he actually lost in the report, that's when he would have got sent home. So it's, um, you know, some of these are, are kind of skewed, like because he has a lot of troops in this one, even though I clearly won this from a losses perspective, on the battle report, he won. So, you know, it may look like a, a quote-unquote loss, but he lost 3 million troops in a single hit. So that's, I mean, that's not really a win now, is it? And then the second one, who was this? When did I, did I not finish him off? Oh, I didn't, I forgot to star reports. Oh, I forgot to star my reports. Dang it. Um, this one. Did I kill this one? Yeah, that's the one I killed. Studious. Um, okay. So, Studious died. Xena. How many troops is that? 10 million troops? For a little bit of resources? So that was another one that I left, which is now bubbled. Okay, so da 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 trick maybe that came with two times four point five mega. Oh man. Yeah, so that's tr that's tough um, when you're getting double mega. The trick, I mean, one of the tricks there could be is. How many troops do you have total, Tom? Like, the other thing you could have potentially done is set five fake rallies um, with full marches and send like four, you know, three to four million of your troops away from home so that you lose the first rally. But that's dangerous because you never know what's going to happen in a rally. And if you got yourself too much, you might lose more than you would have by taking both. So it's it's really, it's a gamble. Oh, you have 19 million? Damn. Okay. All right. Well, let's see. How many do I have? I, I was actually kind of close to that number. I'm at 17. I'm at 18. Which I also have, I've got some in here. So I've got 80k in here that I need to revive out still. And then the regular hospital, I have 146. And then in this hospital, I've got some too. Okay. Was there anything else in this kingdom? worth looking at before it's time to, to call it a night. Um, I checked them already. I'm going to follow this white line. Don't get sick. Always follow the white lines because sometimes it leads you to hives that you didn't know existed. Ooh. Okay, there's an intersection. So quickly make a bookmark here so that I can come back and trace from that spot. That's one of my tricks when I'm 
when I'm scouting kingdoms, this is one of my best tricks. It's following following lines, and there's another target, okay? You follow the lines to targets. That's how we do it, okay? You guys watched it live. So now we're here. Let's see what these guys have. Scouting all the farms, because I love farms. Farms are my favorite. I like to kill farms, because they usually have more resources to troop ratio. Pokemon has nothing. Chop Cheese has not a ton of resources, but I think we're going to go for it. Because I wasted a teleport to get over here, and I don't want to do that without making it worthwhile. So we're going. Um, 4.5 billion? Now 3.3? That's insane. Who is megaing you? Like, were these mega, mega bigs that were megaing you? Like, that's crazy, man. Okay, let's take a look at that hit, see what happened. Okay, so I won, which means I already got the resources, and we killed over half. So the next hit should finish it, and that's a big amount of points, too. That is big. Chica has nothing. Nicodemus has nothing. Flavio has nothing. Keep scouting. Scout, scout, scout. I always scout. I know people just attack without scouting. Those are the people that have special airship, whatever it's called, Merc airships. If I had Merc airship going, I would just be sending marches and YOLOing it, but I don't want to send marches out and get rained and lose troops and regret my life decisions. Nothing over here other than the one. Okay, so now, there's one more to scout over here. Whoop, what's that? Ooh, he's too big. Too big, most likely. But we're going to scout it anyways and see. And anything that says farm, you scout. Always scout things that say farm, all right? Because you never know when you're going to find some silly little, you know, Castle 10 that somebody put 5 billion resources on. So Flavio, Mr. Flavio, has 10 million troops. So many tier 12s. 7, 8 million tier 12s. Ooh. And he's reigned. Let's see if he's in his proper gear. Okay, his research is higher than mine. He's in the right talents. His gear, similar. He's in the right battle gear. His buildings are similar. His curiosities are less. Yeah, he's too high for me to attack into 10 million troops. It'll hurt too much. Farms. Farms, nothing. Come on, farms, don't let me down. All I want is another billion resources. <laughs> is that too much to ask? Is it, though? Okay, so this is a hive that I completely missed earlier. And I'm glad that I was following the lines. Because I never would have found this one. And I missed this one, so let's scout that. Um, oof, there's more. I missed a good hive. There was a lot here. Let's scout it just to see. It's all thanks to this guy. So these guys up here led me right to their friends. So always follow the lines, guys, because sometimes it takes you into a hive. Let's look at this one. Oh, 293 million. That is so dead. Let's keep scouting things, because we scout everything. You guys are seeing a theme here, right? Okay, so. I got a 0 to 20 million troop 1. Oh my gosh, that's insane. 
how many points do you have? Like 20 billion points? So this one, Petasaurus, has 4.4 million troops. Way too much artillery. Yikes. Somebody's been watching Gun Muse. Um, <laughs> sorry, sorry for anybody that watches Gun Muse. Um, <laughs> I apologize if you guys watch him as well. Um, so, okay, this one here has how much? 2.7 million. And he's right next to Pete Soros, who had some troops. So let's go get closer. So RG, we're hitting. We're going for it. And then we're going to scout this one. What else was I scouting over here? And I got to not lose that other one. So Petasaurus and Ashley still has troops on her castle. Okay, so this one looks like I got about half of it. Let's take a look at the report, see what happened. So we broke through the low tiers and the rain or part of the rain. So this next one will probably be deceiving because it will have less kills. Um, so I think this one will have less kills, even though there's less troops. Oh man. Gunmuse was, I, I haven't watched it myself and I don't plan to, but they're saying like, he was super upset about not being invited to that last, um, stream. And he was like, totally upset about it. Bad mouthing all of the other YouTubers. So, you know, it's not like it's new to me. He used to badmouth me on his stream all the time for no reason. Like, never did anything to the guy. I uh, used to watch his channel until one of the times I'm watching his channel and he's like, Keychain, that guy sucks at his job. He doesn't know what he's doing, blah, blah, blah. And he just started going off. And I was like, dude, first off, this is my hobby, not my job. I'm doing it for fun. Uh, and then second, he doesn't know what I do for work, but if I was malicious, I could easily bring down that um, <laughs> that that website that he, uh, he so loves. I could destroy that website without even trying. Um, so, you know, it's... I'm going to keep the high road and, and stay above that. So Miss Ashley over here has a lot of troops left and is not in an alliance. So I think this is one of those decoy ones I was talking about where they kick it out of the alliance to try and make it look dead. But it's not dead. Yeah, he. I think he just... I don't think he realizes how abrasive of a person he is. Um... Like, I really, I really don't think he's trying to do that. I think he just doesn't realize that he is a very um, kind of rough individual. So, okay, so this one we've got... We killed all of the low-tier infantry and some of the distance. So the next hit... Oh, we killed almost all of the infantry other than the tier 11, which should die last. The next hit should get into the distance in the calf, and then the hit after that will be a pretty pretty good one. Should should be a cleaner. And then we'll look at plus Petasaurus again. Um, the other thing I need to do while this is marching is I need to go back to the other bookmark before it's too late and trace back. So... Somebody, oh, what's down here? Nothing. Tracing lines, so nothing down here. But we're going to follow this one. 
Oh, I went the wrong way. Oh, jeez. Okay. So this this little cluster is all spread out. They're so spread out. Why are they? This is crazy. I don't know why they're so like massively spread out, but following lines all over the map to find people. Motion sickness warning. Okay, it's a little castle. Okay, so what happened with Ashley? Ashley, I'm guessing, probably quit the game and just had a ton of troops, and now every kingdom raid, somebody gets to come back and smack her around for a bunch of kills, but no resources, sadly. Still at 37 people. Thanks, everybody. Like, this is a pretty long stream so far. 7.45. Um, I'm, s I'm still kind of surprised that nobody... Nobody came to that party. The resource party. This has been a pretty good raid so far. I'm going to check my points in a minute here, but I'm guessing it's pretty good. Jeez, Ashley. Come on now. Uh, okay, almost done killing Ashley. Let's bookmark these, because why not? Um, whoops, I don't want to bookmark that one. There's nothing there. So we'll just bookmark some of these to save, because it's fun to look back at them sometimes. So RG's dead. Plesiosaurus, we'll look at him in a minute. I'm going to smack Ashley one more time. Um, da -da 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 -da. So 592, you're going to be in the same... Um, you're going to be in the same uh, migration group as me if I'm still around. Um, so I'm waiting to kind of see what happens, but I am not really feeling the game that much anymore. But we're really going to be able to tell with this next update if they listened to us at all during that boycott meeting. If they release a new feature or something that's pay to win during this next update in two days, um, probably just done. Like outright. Um, we'll we'll see but if it's a good patch and they fix bugs and glitches and don't release anything new then there's hope and i'll give it another two weeks so pete has less research he is in the right talent spec he is in the right gear but it's significantly lower than mine Lower buildings. Lower curiosities. Oh yeah, he's only got like 20k stats. So we're going to smack that castle too. We're going for it. Um, man, the chat got so quiet. Like, where'd everybody go? Everybody just enjoying the show? I'm actually killing troops this time instead of just resources. Okay, so first hit... Pretty good. 2.7 million left. Uh, oh, let's look at the actual stats. Oh my gosh, I was way off my estimate. What the heck was I doing? Um, I don't know, but... Okay, so we got through the infantry. All of his infantry is gone, first hit. All of his lower tier cavalry... And he's still got some low tier distance and high tier distance left. And then, of course, artillery. So this next hit should be pretty crippling. Um, it should hit pretty hard. And then after that, I mean, we'll look around again. But I was, I was close to being done because I thought I was out of targets. Because all the other kingdoms were bubbled up. But this one, I've only been in this kingdom the whole time and it has been a gold mine it has been an absolute gold mine this lovely little kingdom let's scout that farm because why not okay so this hit looks like he's still got 1.3 million left we'll take a look at the battle but all of his cavalry are gone. He's down to 
just distance and artillery. So I would send a full cavalry march against that one. I will. Uh, nothing on any of these worth hitting. Okay, so this guy, we're going to attack that, and I'm going to reduce this, increase this, and we're going full cav. And that should clear out the rest of these distance. And artillery. And I think that was it. Yep, cleared it out. God, that was a lot of true death for him. So we true killed 135k, another 140, so that's 270. Another 72, so that's 340. Is that the... Oh, no, so this one is somebody else. So 240k true death for him. That's a little rough. <sighs> okay. Um, does anybody see anything else in this kingdom? We're going to random just to get off the spot so I don't get frozen or something dumb. Because there was a 12 billion power player hunting around here. Um, so, you know, you never really want to run into that. Okay, so they are still under King's or Alliance Bubble. I wonder if there's anything in here, like, sometimes I come into the forest, and they have all these annoying, like, forest blocker castles around here. I go and kill those things and port them out of there during Kingdom Raid if I see them. Just because it annoys me. Not that I really go in the forest much during KVK, but, you know, you know what I'm saying. Okay, so that one's dead. These are probably dead. I'll just double check some of these real quick and see if I didn't if I missed something. I think I hit these guys already. I can't even remember who I've already hit. Jeez, I need some caffeine, but it's actually closer to bedtime, so maybe not. Are those Groot's farms? Oh I wonder. <laughs> I wonder if Groot's got resources on his farms. And he sits right in the middle of them normally at his 12 billion power and says, nobody's going to mess with my farms. Interesting. Okay, motion sickness warning. I'm going to check this way. Oh, nothing there. Okay, going the other way. Probably dead. This is where I'm at currently, isn't it? Pretty close to it. I'm pretty sure I came here already. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, I did, because I killed Studious. Okay. Okay, okay. More bookmarks. Um, I think I'm about done, guys. I can't find anything else unless somebody else finds something amazing or I just stumble upon something else that is alive. Um, we're getting close to it. But depending on how things go... Because this has been such a good kingdom raid so far. I might go again tomorrow. Because there are two kingdoms that everybody was bubbled. And I'm guessing that maybe some of them won't be as good tomorrow. Okay, so this one. There's probably troops there. 565 million on a C-33. But do I actually care that much? 
Do you guys think there's resources on this? And is chat actually dead, or am I just missing it on my tablet? Or is, like, my sound gone, and I didn't know it, and, like, it's just been silent, and nobody's been talking to me? Um, so there's a few potential troops in here, actually. Okay, let's... Let's go look. He probably has resources. I knew somebody was going to say it. As soon as somebody said he probably has resources, you knew that I was going to go check. I was waiting for somebody to say, nah, he probably doesn't have any resources. Why would he? He's probably already zeroed. Let's see. No resources and barely any troops. So apparently the bar is so high now that a 500 and what is that 565 million castle has no troops on it like the power inflation is just insane like it makes it so hard to scout like to visually scout during Kingdom Raid and stuff when castles are that high powered and dead. Well, let's scout it all and just double check since we're here. I already wasted the port, might as well. <laughs> okay, check the line phone was off from Wi Fi. Ah. So what kingdoms am I up against this time? I am up against 293, which is the best kingdom ever. Love it. Haven't left here the whole time. 399 and 449, both of which are like super mega super bubbled. And there's just nothing. Like I didn't even port there because there was just nothing. Well, or the, the castles that were unbubbled, Groot was there. And Groot had already killed the whole kingdom. So... He didn't leave anything for my live stream. Um, which, it's okay, Groot. I forgive you this time. Um, I was kind of thinking that at some point I was going to get speed hit by Groot. I was kind of thinking that that was going to happen and it was going to kill my raid. But it didn't so far. Knock on wood. Um... Ooh, while I've got everybody here, um, there is a phone case company that I'm sponsored by now called GSI, or GIS, GSI, GIS, G those, oh man, I can't figure them out because at work, we have a GIS and a GSI, and I've been saying them so much the last couple of days, um, but in the description of this video, not right now, but when I'm done, I'm going to put that in there, um, You've got custom phone cases for games that you play. You can do your name, you know, Alliance, Kingdom, etc. But if you want to pay a little more, you can send custom artwork and have them fully customize a phone case with your own artwork. It's sick. <laughs> and I really like the phone case itself. Like, it feels sturdy and it's that nice matte finish so it doesn't slide around all the place. Like, these phone cases are amazing. Uh, and I'm going to put the coupon code in the bottom, but if you use my coupon, you get 20% off. Um, so, you know, if you want to design a custom phone case, like you could send a, you know, a picture of a castle 44 or one of the castle skins you love and like have that put on your phone case. And like, it's, it's amazing. You guys, like, I really like this phone case. So if you're interested in getting a new phone case, they have, Lots of them for a lot of the new brands. Uh, and yeah, we'll have a link for that in the description. So uh, I wonder if I can't find if I can't find the link right now while I'm while I'm here. Um, da, da, da. So GSI phone cases. It 
It's Gamer Psy. Hey, there it is. Okay. So let me copy this. Let me get back in here. Shameless advertising, everybody. So, here it is. Um, there's the link. And the code is GSI Keychain Gaming. Okay, there's the link. And if you use that, you get 20% off. So, um, the other thing that there's on there is you can do like group um, buys. Like, if you want to design a phone case for a group and have everybody, you know, get in on it, you can do stuff like that too. So, okay, enough advertising for that one. I'm going to quickly look for a couple more bookmarks. Then we're going to end the stream because. If I do this again tomorrow, looking for more targets, I want to have some voice left. And if, I don't know if you guys have ever tried it, but talking for an hour and a half to two hours straight makes your voice super raspy the next day. It is rough on your voice. Okay, so we've got an intersection here, so we need to bookmark this. We need to go look at what's happening. So, oh, this is where we already were. I already bookmarked like on that same spot too, didn't I? Is it the same castles? It is. It's the same castles leading me back to them. Uh, the other thing that I do when I'm checking for bookmarks is I check the corners. Um, so I always check the corners for alliances. And one of the things I do when I'm looking that people will get motion sick, so I don't do in here that often, is I start in a corner and then I just scroll in one direction, like the whole map. I'll just try and scroll across the same direction, like the whole map, and go from here all the way across and try and find stray castles that may have randomly ported. The other thing I like to check is lakes and rivers because those are often places that people set up for UAC. Um, so I do that and then I just check all over the map and I look for bookmarks wherever I might be able to find something. Um, and that's kind of my system. So I already went to these guys, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I did. And I cleaned them all out. Were any of these names new? Like, I think I've already gutted this kingdom enough. Did I kill this? Yeah, I did. Okay. Well, does anybody have any more questions, comments, uh, anything? Uh, shout outs to everybody. I could do specific shout outs for people who. You know, want me to say their alliance or kingdom name, whatever. Oh, what do we got? Nope, he's dead. Dang, it was, it was almost, I was almost hopeful that I found one more set of targets. But these are all dead already. Dang it. That was an almost exciting moment. No honor here. So, yeah. We're not getting any points from that one. And this is where I just was. And... I think... I mean, I really think we're out. Did anybody find any? Is anybody scouting for me? Nada. Okay, everybody. Um... I'm going to call it a night. So thanks again for showing up. I appreciate the support. Um, I hope everybody enjoyed watching. We got a grand total of, let's see, 5.5 billion points. We're number one. And we got 1.2, nope, 1.3, 1.4 billion resources. So pretty successful. Kingdom Raid, all in all. I'm quite happy with that. And 
hopefully tomorrow we can check some bookmarks in these other kingdoms that were fully shielded. Like all of these alliance bubbles aren't going to end for another like hour. And by then I'm going to be want to uh, wind down for bed since I do work tomorrow. So, all right. Thanks for watching. Have a good night. Uh, I appreciate all the support and I'll see you in the next video.